I love the toothbrush, I love the mouthwash, I love the toothpaste, but the first thing I do is I use dental floss. And this isn't the dental floss I use, it just was in my office and I pulled it out. I don't even know how to do this. So yeah, I cut a piece off and what I do is I wrap it around my fingers like this and then I stick it in my teeth, you know. Uh, uh. And the reason is this, this gets in between the teeth where the toothbrush, the, well the toothpaste can go and the mouthwash can go, but the toothbrush can't go. This gets into areas where the toothbrush can't work. And I do this before I brush my teeth and then the toothbrush comes in and gets rid of all the other stuff. Is there an area of your life that is so tight or so private that nobody, nothing gets in there? Let me give you an illustration. I had a man come in my office a couple years ago with a hidden sin and I won't name the sin and nobody knew about it but it was destroying him and it was hurting his family yet his family never knew about it and all of a sudden what happened is the holy spirit used me like dental floss to be able to go deep into his spiritual life to help him get rid of the evil through the power of the holy spirit for some of us we have stuff stuck in our spiritual life that is causing a spiritual cavity and we need to get in there and get it out. How? Well, the Bible says that if we ask the Holy Spirit, He is faithful and just not only forgive us of our sins, but to cleanse us from unrighteousness if we confess. The word cleansing means that the Holy Spirit will be the dental floss that goes into our spiritual life and finds those hidden things that needs to be cleansed, but we need to give time to the Holy Spirit. Hey, think about what I just said. God bless. Have a great day.